guys, Versky1 here today. Welcome to a Blender tutorial. Today I'll be showing how to make uh, uh, patches of grass, basically. So um, you might want to get started by going into cycles. Uh, I kind of I mostly just do everything in cycle just because it's easier and stuff. But uh, I'll just uh, get everything off the screen uh, except the camera, I guess. Um, you want to just for the ground for now, just uh, get a plane. It doesn't really matter the color or anything right now. And then you want to go to add mesh, and then um, cylinder. And then before, don't move it because then you don't get this thing over here. You want to change vertices to eight, so you get this uh, kind of um, low poly look. Then you want to size it down just so it looks maybe like that's good size. I don't something like that. Just kind of um, good size for a blade of grass. And now you want to go into edit mode. You want to go down here where it's face selecting mode, select this top face. Uh, if you have a Mac, this won't work, but if you do have a Mac, use a number pad seven. Go use the things to go down. So you have this. And go into orthographic mode, which uh, is like the button five. So you have this uh, nice smooth thing right here. And then what you want to do is you want to press E, which is extrude. Make it taller. Size it down with S. Make it a bit smaller. And then kind of tilt it to the right or to the left, doesn't really matter. Uh, so you want to do it again. Tilt it to the left this time, because it's opposite direction. Size it down so it's even smaller. And one more time, uh, extrude. Uh, I'm going to move it right over here and make it even smaller, like right there. So now you have this weird shape of grass. And uh, you want to go out of orthographic mode and edit mode. And you want to size this down. So this may seem a little bit weird now. This is just weird little bladed grass thing that looks like a piece of hair, but whatever. So to make this look like a piece of grass, you have to more, add more grass. So you want to do shift D, make another one. Uh, don't move it and do R. So we can move it down like that. Do it again. Except over here. And basically just do this um, for all the sides. So we have this little blade grass thingy. And <laughs> um, let's see. One more time. You just basically want to... Sorry. You basically just want to do this bunch everywhere. So like maybe size this down a tiny bit or something. And or duplicate it. And move it over here. I don't know, just kind of mess it around, mess, just mess around with it a little bit so it actually looks like grass. <laughs> so, oh, no, one thing I should have done before I, you know, made all these copies and stuff is uh, make it green. Let me go to the textures tab of your new, and then make some kind of green color. Uh, here, maybe make it down a little bit. Uh, just kind of, uh, just kind of green color, so... Oh, I don't have any sun. Looks kind of bad. <laughs> okay, wait. Sorry, let me just do this quick thing. Uh, sorry. Ambient inclusion. And, ooh, yes. That's maybe a little high. Mm, like, that's good. And then not a sun. Or a lamp point. So it looks more realistic. Uh, here, I should turn it up. To 5,000, yeah. Oh, that's a little bright, never mind. <laughs> Usually works good for stuff, but yeah, here that's a little bit better. Just put it over here. And yeah, okay, let's do this. So let's just uh, just make a bunch of, basically just want to make a bunch of these little uh, blade, blades of grasses and stuff and just kind of maneuver them around and stuff and, you know. So I have like a little patches of grass. And maybe I'll take this and size it down actually. Kind of fat. Let's see. Like that's like see now you kind of starting to get this little feeling of grassness. <laughs> but you know. Yeah. So 
maybe you just you just want to kind of spread it out. That's basically. And then uh, maybe I'll take this um, I'll take this one little plan I made here and duplicate it some. So now we could go up here. I don't know, we don't have to go. And, like I could just move it around, which is kind of nice. Uh, so basically you just want to do this uh, several times until maybe size it down. It's kind of feeling, oops, before I should, I should, uh, well, I should have made it one. So how you do this is you have all of these pieces selected and do control J. So it becomes one mesh object. So if I click on it, you don't have to like click on each individual one. So, uh, yeah, I'll just move it around some. Like this, and size it down some. Is a little big. Uh, it does look kind of weird right now, to be honest. Uh, I think one thing that could help is these more individual ones. So instead of all these random other ones, but so we just kind of add these individual grasses. Uh, maybe like that side. Uh, it's not quite on the ground. There we go. So just kind of, you know, just kind of spread it out. Like uh, so. And let's see. I I think I have to make all of these. Should have thought. Oh, okay. So at least it's more green. Let's see, there's still some white ones, though. Let's see if I could just... That? No. Uh, I think I have to do, like... What was it? It was something P, I think. Uh, whatever. I mean, it's not a huge deal for now, but... Well, I mean, it kind of is, but... <laughs> okay. I'll just pick out these, uh... Well, I'll just do it off camera, but... Uh, I'll just color all these, but anyways, uh, so you basically just want to make all these, uh, plants, or these little tiny weeds, and maybe, like, the small individual blast bl grass blades, oh my gosh, and, uh, yeah, it's pretty much it, I guess, um, here, like, like, uh, more tilted is better, I think, in my opinion. And, you know, the more the merrier, but... Um... Anyways, uh... I think that should be it. Hmm. Well, it's kinda... Here, wait. Let's see if I could... Here, add another... Go up here. Uh... Hmm. Deciding what to add. I, I did this before. It was a little bit better, but... Maybe I should select all these and duplicate them. Okay, that'd be a good idea. So, maybe it'd be a good idea to select all these uh, little tiny ones. And then duplicate those. And put them around just everywhere. Uh, yeah. So, just kind of these look of yeah okay um yeah there's still a lot of white so it's not looking so great at the moment but uh so i guess i'll just do the rest off screen because basically just duplicating this a ton and etc but yeah so i'll report back to you when i'm done and yeah so hey guys i'm back and this is the end product. It's pretty nice. You see in the background. Uh, it could even be more so. Yeah, and even more. Uh, yeah, it would get laggier, but... Uh, yeah, anyways, the uh, game out pretty well. What I did is I selected every single piece, which is I went sideways. And then I did control J on all of them. Which made it a bit less laggy. And uh, it made them so they all had the same texture. So the white ones didn't have... Uh, you know, they weren't white, but, uh, yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, uh,